a good guardian ghost and getting Minnie and me a cup of chocolate. <laughs> gotcha. Two hot chocolates coming up. I think I got it right. Whoa! Just look at you, kid. What a sorry excuse for a ghost. Oh, hi, Harry. I'm disgusted with you, boy. Gotcha. Two hot chocolates coming up. I tell you, kid, you're disgusting. How many times must I tell you, Harry Scary? I'm not a ghost. I'm a guardian ghost. Oh, good. Hot chocolate, just the way I like it. I'm glad, Minnie. Attention, attention. The commander. In cooperation with the space community and police involvement plan, I'm asking for two volunteers to act as camp directors for a space kid camp out. And those two volunteers are you. Maxie and Minnie. Camp directors? Oh, boy. A space kid camp out. Whoopee! Neato! Hoggy doodly do. Isn't it exciting, Harry? We're going on a space kid camp out. I never told you, kid. I'm an old space kidaroo from way back. Hey! Hold it. Hold it. Hold everything. Who invited you, Harry Scary? <laughs> oh, let him go too, Maxie. He might be a help at that. Well, okay. If you promise to stay out of trouble, Harry. I promise, I promise. Cross my sheets and hope to live. <laughs> hope to live, oh, Harry, you kill me. <laughs> Yay! Remember, silence is golden. Okay, now hear this. I am yours truly, Harry Scary. Your ghost? Oh, now. Are we gonna keep it down? Yes, yes sir. sir! There's the space campsite dead ahead! Dead? Now that's my kind of country! <laughs> All right, space kids! The first thing we do is set up tents! Harry! If you must play that bugle, Harry, why don't you practice playing on tune, and preferably somewhere way off in the distance? <laughs> Everybody's a critic. <laughs> I guess I know what I'm not wanted. <laughs> this campfire isn't big enough for both of us. The pup tents are all up, Camp Director Maxie. That's very good, Larry. Now, well... Hey, where's Minnie and Casper? Over here, Max! What is going on? That's not the way you set up a pup tent. Jumpin' Jupiter, Maxie. Why not? You can get into this tent standing up. See? But it doesn't cover you. Oh, never mind, Minnie. One of the space kids will fix it. I guess we goofed, Minnie. Oh, um, Casper. Yes, Maxie? Would you go look for Harry Scary? Do you need him? All we need is for him to get lost in the forest. Yoo-hoo! Harry Scary, where are you? Oh, Harry Scary, where are you? Harry Scary? What kind of name is that? Oh, hello, Mr. Beaver. Harry Scary is my friend. He's a ghost. A ghost? Yeah! He won't hurt you. Are, 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 are you a ghost? <laughs> yes, but I'm a guardian ghost. Big deal, huh? 
some guardian ghost you are, going around scaring people with stories of ghosts. But I just look at here. You put me behind in my schedule. Oh, gee. Standing around here, chit-chattering about ghosts and not getting my lodge built. I'm terribly sorry, Mr. Beaver. Maybe I can help you catch up. Wow! Well, slap my tail. How about that? Thanks, kid. If I can ever do you a favor, just give me a wish. So... I will, Mr. Beaver. Thank you for the offer. Yoo-hoo, Harry Scary, where are you? Harry Scary, yoo-hoo! Gee, no sign of him. Uh, where's there a spot I can play my bugle in privately, uninterrupted and unbothered? There ought to be a place around here, Thump. Aha! A cave! Perfect! A biggity dog, Harry, old boy, you must live right! <laughs> live right! <laughs> up to your old tricks. <laughs> I tell you, kid, there's just no privacy in this forest. Golly, Harry! Why don't you practice your bugle playing in the space bus? I definitely do! You got it, kid! Now, why didn't I think of that? Hey! What in the gobbledygook is that? Look, Harry! It's a meteorite shower! Owee, kiddo! They must have hit near! Come on, Harry! Let's look! 23 skippy days! A meteorite hit the dam! My goodness! It's not anything serious! It is serious, Harry! If the crack in the dam widens, it'll flood the Space Kids campground! Like I said, kid, this is serious! Somebody's gotta warn Minnie and Maxie! Right, Harry! You go and warn the girls! I'll try and figure out a way of stopping the water! No sooner said than done, kid! Remember, if all else fails, panic! Oh, you just gotta figure out a way of stopping that water! But how? Look, see, the campsite should be over there. Uh-huh, just as I thought. I'm lost, definitely lost. Aha, uh -huh. but not for long. I've found my old bugle waggles distress call. Golly, Maxie, maybe we'd better send out for hamburgers. Now what's wrong? I think I burned the soup. But how can you burn soup? Golly, it was easy. You see, I... It's Harry and his horn. I thought I warned Harry about that horrible music. It's coming from over there. Harry, I'm warning you. That's funny. I'm here to warn you. The dam is breaking up. Uh-oh, emergency. Minnie, you take the space kits to higher land. Right, Maxie. I'm going to the space bus radio. Can I help? Can I, huh? Let me do a 10-4, or a 10-5, even. Hello, hello. This is an emergency. Breaker, breaker. Emergency repairs needed at Space Kid Campground. Hello, hello. You don't say. What's the matter there? Did the Space Kids run out of hot dogs? <laughs> oh, no. Just what we don't need, a clowning sea beer. A big mic mouther, eh? Oh, give it a thought, Maxie. This is my specialty. I'll get on his wavelength. Or better yet, did the Space Kids forget to bring their matches? <laughs> Hey, why don't you get off the air and let me talk to some of my buddies, chum? Hey, who? Got your ears on, fella? Well, copy this. <laughs> yeah, a ghost! <laughs> okay, Maxie, you've got a clear channel. Thanks, Harry. Request emergency aid at Space Kit Campsite. The dam is broken. Great, Jim. The Space Kid Campsite. Well, I've seen emergency repairs done to dams before, but never one quite like this. Thanks, Beavers. You saved the dam and the day. It was a cinch. 
Casper. Enlisting the aid of those beavers was pure genius. Not only that, it was smart, too. Gee, thanks. But remember, it was Harry's bugle plane that helped him find you, Maxie. You mean we found him. Nice work, Harry. Here, here. I'll give you an hour to cut that out. <laughs> Well, thanks to you and Harry, Casper, the Space Kids had a successful camp out. Say, where is that budding musician Harry Scary? Well, don't look now, but I think Harry's about to form his own rock band. <laughs> Sure, clear the head. <laughs> this is one time Harry Scary rings true. <laughs>